Saturday evening to you. I'm Joe Holdren. The county's mail-in ballot vendor is believed to have sent more than 600 ballots to the wrong people. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Reed was at today's hearing and brings us the latest from media. Joe, voters are concerned and candidates running for office here in Delaware County are also concerned. The fear is that the integrity of the upcoming election may be at stake. This after third party vendor Election IQ that was hired by Delaware County is said to have mailed incorrect ballots to over 600 residents. The petition was filed on behalf of two Republican candidates that say the extent of the errors is unknown. There are a variety of complaints. Some people say they they still haven't received their mail in ballots and we're three days from election day. In addition, voters testifying at today's emergency hearing at the Court of Common Pleas say that after receiving incorrect ballots, they went to the courthouse to rectify the mistake, but were told their votes had already been cast. This mishap is a bipartisan issue and affects both Republican and Democratic voters. In the past, races in some small boroughs have come down to one or two votes, so as you can imagine, Imagine this mishap is a major cause for concern. Nobody knows at this point in time what the extent of the problem is. We do know that it's grown from where it was six, six persons to at least 600, and there was at least 5,000, I think it was 5,700 ballots that were mailed out beyond the statutory date when they had to be mailed out. We are waiting to hear from officials what recourse voters will have for Tuesday's election. In the meantime, we have reached out to Election IQ. We still haven't heard back. Of course, we'll stay on top of this and have the latest in tonight's newscast. Reporting from Delaware County, Alicia Reed, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. And stay with CBS 3 Eyewitness News, CBSN, and CBSPhilly.com for a complete coverage as voters decide this Tuesday, November 2nd. It was a